The United States should persuade Israel to provide military assistance to Kiev, Ukrainian ambassador to Tel Aviv Evgeny Kornichuk has said. In an interview with The Hill newspaper, published on Sunday, Kornichuk claimed that, as the U.S., is the only country that Israel is listening to. Washington should also ensure that its close ally abides by Western sanctions on Russia. Revealing that he meets with the U.S. ambassador to Israel on a weekly basis, Kornichuk jokingly referred to Tom Nides as a secret weapon in his campaign to push Israel out of its neutral status. This is why we discuss the different measures of support, and again, we need to change this major trend that makes Israel's position different from the rest of the democratic world and have more military technical cooperation," he said. The Ukrainian ambassador admitted that there has been some positive development in relations with Israel, which recently offered his country a missile warning system. However, Ukraine is expecting more from Israel, of course, he said. He expressed hope that alleged military collaboration between Russia and Iran and Ukraine, something that both countries have been denying, would make Israel change its stance on arms supplies. Kornichuk's remarks came less than a week after Israeli Defense Minister Benny Gantz, citing the operational limitations, made it clear to his Ukrainian counterpart Alexei Reznikov that Israel will not provide weapon systems to Ukraine. However, Israel is prepared to continue supplying Kyiv with humanitarian aid and life-saving defense equipment, Gantz said. Russia, meanwhile, has been consistently warning the West against pumping up Ukraine with weapons explaining that it would only prolong the conflict and cause unnecessary casualties. Kornichuk revealed that the second most important issue for him, after getting military assistance from Israel, is to ensure that Israel enforces anti-Russia restrictions. While Tel Aviv doesn't have its own sanctions legislation, its government said the country is doing everything it can in order to be part of the international sanctions effort. The issue of sanctions is also important and the Americans are in a much better position to check whether the Israelis are following those sanctions or not," Kornichek said. A Treasury Department spokesperson told The Hill that it works closely with its partners, including Israeli, to cut off avenues for Russia to evade sanctions.